Hey everybody, how's it going? Today I'll be reviewing running boards from iBoard Auto. They sent me these uh, running boards. They are sponsoring this video. This is going to be for a 2017 Chevy Colorado or a GMC Canyon. This is, says for 2015 to 2016, but they're basically the same. They will work. With this, they send you obviously the installation instructions. They send you uh, all the brackets, as you can see here. And they are pretty heavy duty brackets. They are stamped with a P and a D for passenger and driver side. And there are three for each side, so there's two others over there for a total of six brackets, three for each side. Obviously, they send you the boards themselves. I have them still packaged up so you can see how they come. Uh, they come in this nice box, another piece on top of it with straps holding it all together. So it, it was definitely packaged very nicely. I was impressed. Lots of styrofoam and padding. The boards are in a plastic wrap to keep them from getting marred by anything. And also you get your, uh, your hardware set, a bunch of screws. The hardware pack comes with an assortment of uh, pieces, a hex head bolt, a spring washer, a regular flat washer, a spring uh, nut, and then also a square head bolt, a nylon lock washer, and then a flat black washer. Um, these square head ones, that's what's going to go into your channel on the back side of the running board. They'll just kind of slide in. There's an open end on the, on the ends where you put them in and just slide them in, and then they're captured by this rail. So these are not, they're not coming out. There's literally no way. And that's what your bracket will mount to. So you have your bracket and there's slotted screw or slotted holes on the underside that will attach. And I'm doing this one-handed backwards. And that's so you can um, adjust your running board on the side of your vehicle if you want them to stick out a little further or if you want them to be held in closer to the to the body. So you can adjust that a little bit there. And then this is the side that will obviously mount underneath the truck to the body or the frame or however the application calls for. And that's what these hex bolts will be used for is mounting that to uh, to the body. So I wanted to give you guys a, show, a shot of all that stuff. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and pull these out so you can see the actual finish. These are the black finish. They are um, aluminum and they also have a uh, silver aluminum. All right guys, here's the one of the boards pulled out of the packaging. And as you can see, this is all black. This is a two piece construction. There is a a rubber grippy pad here on top that is very well secured. I mean, I can't pull it off at all. It's probably adhered with some sort of adhesive. And then also here on the ends, you can see they got some rivets down on the edge, edges to keep them from peeling back over time. Um, and then the underside is, uh, is aluminum, so these won't rust. Also nice. There's no seams or anything. It's all one solid piece of aluminum. Really nicely constructed. They do come in different widths. This is a five inch. They also have a four inch and then they also have a six inch. So you can you know, customize it however you like. And then it is a black finish or there's a silver finish. So you can pick based on what you like. I went with black and my truck is black and I like black. So that's the top side with that grippy pad. And then on the underside, there is this channel, which is where you will put in your bolts to attach the brackets. So you got this whole channel that runs the length of the boards here. That's, that allows it to be used on several different types of trucks. It's not one truck specific. Chances are, if you can put running boards on your truck, these will work. Um, if you go onto the iboardauto.com website, I'm sure you can find your truck. They have a good search tool to figure out what fits your vehicle. And I do believe they come in different lengths as well. So if you have a longer truck or a shorter cab truck, you know, you can find something that fits. So I am going to be doing an install video on these. It's a relatively simple process. Once again, I'd like to thank iBoard Auto for sending me these. And um, I'm really, really happy with them. They're, they're really nice uh, boards. And this finish on it is kind of, it's got a little bit of a texture to it. I don't know, I like it. It's, it's in interesting. So I'll be happy to get these on the truck. Yeah, so stay tuned for the install video and give this video a thumbs up. And once again, Make sure you guys go check out iBoard. I'll put a link in the description for their website. Stick around and we'll catch you on the next video. Thanks guys.